Hey, what's going on guys? This is Pete with Auto Repair Tips. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and don't forget to hit the bell for notifications. Working on a 2001 Ford Expedition. Customers complain is the right rear door, the window motor doesn't go up and down correctly. It goes down, but it won't go back up. In this video, I'm going to show you how to check that problem and fix it. This is the connector going to the motor. The wires going to the motor are red and yellow. Coming from the switch is brown with a yellow stripe and brown. And this is the switch. It's the back of the plug to the switch. All right, what we're going to do is we're going to hook up the switch just like this. Okay. I'm going to go with push the down button the window is going down I'm gonna push the up button the window is not doing anything okay what you're gonna do I'm gonna plug the switch in I'm gonna show you something okay what I've got is I've got a lead going to the battery reds on the positive this goes to the battery is green that's for negative I've got a multimeter set on volts when this switch is in the neutral position, there's a ground signal going to both sides of these wires. An easy way to check it is, take the multimeter, I'm gonna put it on the hot side of the battery. I'm gonna unplug the switch, and I'm gonna touch one side of the wire. You have 13 volts. What that shows you is, that's giving you a good ground, which gives you 13 volts on your meter. We're gonna switch sides and check the other side. All right, 13 volts, both sides are getting a good ground. I've taken a test light, I've hooked it to the wire going to the ground side of the battery so I can check for voltage. Okay, because we know we have ground, good ground both sides. So if I put it right here, the brown wire, and hit the down button, all right, I have volts. Go to the other side, nothing. So what that's showing you is, you're getting the correct ground going to the motor, but the hot coming through the switch is only providing it to one side. So another way to check it is, I'm gonna take a hot lead coming from the battery, I'm gonna put it on the brown wire with the yellow stripe right here. I'm gonna take the other one and I'm gonna touch the solid brown wire when the window's going up. If I switch it, those motors have reverse polarity in it, so when you switch it, now I've got the red going to the solid brown the positive lead, and the green's ground's gonna go right here to the brown with the yellow and it goes down. So I know manually jumping it here at the harness connector, the motor's working correctly. And that's an easy way to test to see if your motor's bad or your switch is bad. In this case, it's gonna be a bad switch. Replace the switch and the problem should be solved.